This is your two-minute update here on MSUSpartans.com. I'm your host, Dave Ellis. As the athletic year begins, we have a new host for Monday Morning Quarterback. It's Andrew Maxwell. Yeah, I think it's been a process, and it's just camp has been the next step in that process. It started way back in, in January and February through winter conditioning, but now I'm really kind of starting to feel comfortable as the guy and starting to feel comfortable as that leader on the field. So um, being a little more vocal, being a little bit more of that guy in the huddle who got, has to get things going, but um, that's going to be a process that continues throughout the year. Congratulations to the volleyball team. The Spikers won their ninth straight Spartan Invitational by winning all three of their matches at Jenison to open the season, dropping only one set along the way. They also set a school record by holding McNeese State to just 39 total points in the opening match. I think it's always nice to kick off the season and get your fans back and reintroduce to the team and meet the newcomers and get an idea of what the, what the outlook is. Uh, you know, I, I enjoy getting started, but I'm glad we came away with them. A mixed bag for women's soccer over the weekend. The ladies down Loyola 3-1 on Friday, but fell 1-0 to Cal State Fullerton Sunday, leaving them at 3-1 on the season. Well, I think they need to, you know, they need to understand we've had a couple personnel challenges and, and uh, that, you know, we, we came back, back and fought hard in the second half, which was a good thing. I just encourage them to, you know, have a good, we have a good week here before we play again. We need to, to regroup, get used to being student athletes uh, again now with school starting. The men have still yet to score a goal in the regular season. They drew nil-nil with Valparaiso on Friday and suffered a shock 1-0 loss to New Hampshire in extra time Sunday. Sometimes the ball is just not going to go in, but I think you got to create your own luck. I think we got nobody to look at but ourselves in this in this loss and uh, you know move forward from it. One other score from Sunday, field hockey picked up win number one of the season with a 3-1 victory at Maine. Abby Barker scored twice, Molly Cassidy made four saves. They'll play Stanford at home on Friday at 3 p.m. Remember, you can always see full cuts of videos on the individual sport pages. That's your two-minute update. I'm Dave Ellis. You give us two minutes, we'll give you the Spartans.